Hey guys, George Renuki here, and today we're going to continue off the Baby Einstein V Chess Collection with part two of the 2022 edition. Now, first video, if you haven't seen it yet, I will link it up here and in the description, was Language Nursery through Van Gogh. This one will be Santa to Beethoven, and this will be a much shorter part. So let's start with Baby Santa. First up, 2000 V Chess. Not in very good condition, but... What can you do? It's a common tape. Front, side, back, other side, top. Here's the tape. I know this window has like a crack on it, but I don't care. Print date is November 10th, 2000. I got this in a lot on like, I think it was offer up. Most of the tapes are in really bad condition. But, oh well, it was dirt cheap. Next, 2002 VHS. Got this one on a lot on eBay. Tape. Print date is October 30th, 2002. Then we have the 2002 with the CD. I don't know why this said PEDS on it. I did get the P off, so now it just says EDS. But it just kind of came like that. I think another one of my tapes used to say PEDS on it. I don't remember which one, but I got it off. Oddly enough, this has a 2003 VHS in it, with a print date of November 4, 2003, but it plays normally. It's not like Baby Anson 12702s, which has the weird thing with the promo. That would have a sticker label, I think. Here's 2003. Black nose version. I don't have red nose. Tape. Um, October 28, 2003. And then the final tape, which is the one I just got in the mail today, the Baby Santa 2004 VHS with the CD, which came sealed, but I opened it. Front side, back, other side, top, inside. Here's the holiday CD that comes with it that still has the Baby Einstein theme on it, of course. I don't know why they put that on everything. There's, there's a reason it's not coming out. There's a 2003 booklet on the other side, but here's the tape. Printed is November 3rd, 2004. Yeah, there was a seller that had like a bunch of these on eBay. So I decided to grab one for myself. Neighborhood Animals, which is the biggest pile. Here's the Bluebird 2001 VHS. Here's the tape. The reels are kind of yellowed, but oh well. Printed is April 23rd, 2001. I think most of them are printed on that day. Here's just one with the cat with the CD. I don't have the cat tape without the CD, and I don't have the bluebird tape with the CD. There's the soundtrack. It's got the green sticker label, regular reels, no print tape. Early 2002 VHS. Tape. Printed is May 31st, 2002. Yes, this tape has a huge crack on the back. In 2017, I stepped on it. I don't really care, though. It's that tape. 2003 VHS. Tape, black reels. Print date is March 15, 2004. This looks like a late 2002 VHS, but it's not. I probably should have showed this before 2003, but it doesn't matter. It is a blue 2003 tape. Print date is November 13, 2003. And finally, my probably one of my worst tapes, although look at the condition. The 2004 VHS with the CD. As you can see, this tape has seen better days. And I got it like this. So, wasn't my doing. It is pretty much falling apart, both the case and the actual VHS. Still works, though. So, I'm grateful for that. But yeah, this is in horrible condition. It's just abysmal. Print date is March 8th, 2005. That's still a crazy print date to me. But yeah, I don't really watch that one much because how bad the condition is. 
Okay, we got World Animals. Three tapes look the same. Here's the 2001 VHS. Print date is September 6th, 2001. Took me forever to get this tape somehow. Here's what well, looks like the 2003 VHS, but it has the wrong VHS in it. I think it used to have a 2003 VHS, but my VCR ate it. But it has a 2002 VHS in it, with a burn date of August 6, 2002. Here's the late 2002 VHS with the CD. There's a soundtrack. And it has an early tape with the same... Or actually, no, this one's different. This one's February 25th, 2002, which is actually the same as one of my Van Goghs, but not any of my World Animals. I thought that one was the same as the other World Animals, but I was wrong. And the actual 2003 VHS. You already pretty much saw the case of this. But this tape has black reels. Print date is February 7th, 2004. And we're flying through the tapes on this part because they're less interesting. Now for B. Newton. 2002 VHS. This has got to be one of the most common Baby Einstein tapes of all time. Here's the tape. Printed as June 11, 2002. And with the CD. I've had three copies of this tape, and only one came with a CD that wasn't destroyed. Here it is. I think this was... Is, was I put it in my first copy, though, because this one's in really good condition, the case and everything. Here's a tape, black top. Print date is June 13, 2002, two days after the other one. And the same as my being Mozart 2002 VHS. And finally, 2003. Print date is January 29, 2004. Alright, 2003 reprint. I'm going to show this tape in between Newton and Beethoven because I think that's when it came out. I don't know. All I know is it's this is the Bay Hansen 2002 VHS sampler. And they do show a little bit of Beethoven, but it shows still shows a prototype cover. So I think it came out before. Front. Side, yeah. Case is a little damaged, but tape's in good condition. Sticker label and big reels, no print tape. I don't really expect a promotional tape to have a print date, so I'm not too surprised. Finally, the stack of 2002 Baby Beethovens and a 2003. Here's the first copy. Yeah, I don't know why I have three, but, you know, it happens. Well, four, technically, but one's with the CD, so it's not the same. Print date is October 11, 2002. Here's a nearly identical copy. Don't have to show the case again. November 7th, 2002. And the final copy is special. Same case and everything. But it's a sticker label copy with black top. I do wonder if this originally came with a CD copy, but considering it came in this box, I don't think that's possible. But I'm not sure. Of course, it has no print date. And this one does not play bass boosted, so that's nice. Because these two obviously play bass boosted. This one does not. So if you want to get a baby in 2002 that's not ear, like, ear bleeding, get it with a sticker label, but that's pretty hard to find usually. The audio is still a little loud, but not as bad. But these two are these two are pretty bad. Anyway, here's what looks like the 2002 VHS with the CD. Well, it almost is. There's only one problem. There's the sampler, which sucks. They, like, use these tracks over and over again, too. I don't know why. Like, every other tape that came out came with the sampler. But it looked different. Stupid. July 10th, 2003. Or they came with that one that had Neighbor Animals and World Animals songs. Yep, we need video versions of all those. <laughs> mm. 2003, final tape. There's a tape, and the print date is March 2nd, 2004. That's surprisingly late, and we do know, of course, 2004 exists. 
but it has a sticker label that doesn't look like that. This one, it would need big reels, and it doesn't have it. Also, I think it would be in a 2003 with the CD case. But anyways, that was a pretty quick run-through of these videos. Next up, of course, we will be doing Bay Neptune to On The Go. Because, well, I think the most I have for one video is four. Three or four. So, there won't be really that many tapes to deal with. And it'll probably be about as quick as this one. So yeah, leave a like down below. Leave a like and a comment down below, I mean. Subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next part. See you guys next time.